Good morning guys, welcome to Ibiza. Today, we're gonna to be getting a Spanish haircut. Didn't get my haircut before lockdown because I thought I wanted to grow it out, but it's proved to be an absolute nightmare since I got here three days ago. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna show the guy a picture on Pinterest. So he's got kind of like a guide, so he can't really go too wrong if you show them a picture. We're about to walk in. Need to put the face mask on, need to put a t-shirt on, face mask on, and let's get this cut. There was a short wait in the barbers, so I've got myself a detox smoothie and a nice black coffee, and then we'll go and get this trim and sort it out. Sit. Hector. 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 <laughs> nice to meet you. I think keep quite long on top. What do you think? Yes, but uh, it must have been cut. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think this is good. Short sides, like yours. Short. Yeah? So do you want a uh, fade? Uh, yes, please. Does it? Yeah. I'll get my friend outside. Okay, go follow the good barber on Instagram. Haircuts in Ibiza and Barcelona. Whoa. Okay, guys. So that is the Spanish trim complete. Um, obviously, the barber was very, very good. He's told me he's 22. He's been cutting hair for eight years already, and he knows. He knowed. He knew. Nod. He knew what he was doing. I didn't even have to really tell him. I showed him one picture of kind of how I would like it, and he was just straight in there. And he was like, "Trust me, trust me, brother." And I was like, "I will trust you." My recommendation, I'll have you know. Yeah, Mikey T's recommendation. Honestly, I'm absolutely buzzing with this haircut. It looks absolutely sick. Don't know if you can see it. And I suppose that is it for this little short and sweet video. It was an absolute pleasurable first Spanish trim and I'm unbelievably happy with it. One thing he did tell me is I need to start conditioning my hair. I actually haven't been using any shampoo or conditioner at all. And obviously I've been in the sea and the pool and stuff so it's probably not in the best of condition. He said it was a little bit dry. But we'll get on that, we'll fix that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.